Hey, it's Nakron, and today I'm going to be doing a bunch of abyssals on my, my, he's a new character. Um, he is on an alpha account. Uh, there we go. That's probably better for you. Um, he is on an alpha account and he is still fairly new. Now I did the million skill points. And I still have 852,000 left. He's showing at two, um, almost 2.5, but um, I have almost a mil here. Um, so he's really about 1.4 ish um, million skill points. And for the most part, I'm just using um, frigates. I do have one destroyer, but um, just been using frigates, and it's been a lot of fun. Um, probably the most fun I've had in Eve for a while now. Um, I definitely enjoying it. Um, it's been different. It's challenging at times. And surprisingly, the loot is really good for, um, alpha accounts. So if you are a new player... And especially if you're using an alpha account, this is definitely, definitely the way to go. Um, I have been earning roughly, I don't know, about um, anywhere from 4 to 5 mil, like every 10 to 15 minutes, depending on which ship I am using and which... Um, filaments I'm doing right now I'm gonna go ahead and I am going to do some firestorm I've got nine in there so that'll give me three to do um, basically every time you go into the abyss with a frigate you need to have three of the filaments with you technically they're made for three um, frigates but you know um, you can do them without it so I'm going to go ahead and warp. It says safe. It's just a area in open space. Um, not worried about anything else. Just, just a place to land where I don't have to worry about anything being nearby that'll not allow me to use my filament. You do need to be in a fleet. As you can see here, I'm in a fleet of one. So it really, you know, you don't have to be a fleet with anybody else. Um... So let's go ahead and we are going to use, you can do it in one cruiser, in two destroyers or three frigates. So basically you're doing a cruiser, you only need one, destroyers you'll need two, and frigates you'll need three. So click on that and it will open it up. I love the, the effects that they have. It's just an amazing game. Never gets old. All right, so I'm going to put in, I guess I can't yet, I'm going to put in my ultraviolet to start. So let's start heading over there. We are going to orbit, and these guys are going to take a little bit to get to me. I am going to put on one of those. And I'm going to start taking him out while I head over to the other one. Oh, okay. We're going to need multiple. Wow. Oh, that's right. I'm not on a shield ship. I forgot. Uh, I completely forgot. I was starting to worry there. I'm like, whoa, why am I taking so much damage? But I forgot that um, this ship here doesn't worry about shields. All right, so we're going to turn that off. We don't need that on anymore because we are um, where we need to be. And um, I'm not too worried about um, anything. It'll help save Cap. They're not going to do too much damage to me, so...
actually, I think I'm going to go ahead and go to my, these go out to seven. Yeah, they should be good. Hmm. Now I thought it would have been doing more damage. No, we won't go. Apparently these guys take more damage from the thermal, so we'll stick with that. Now it roughly takes me um, about eight minutes, I want to say, to finish with um, the firestorm with this frigate. And I'm getting roughly four to five mil, or I'm sorry, um, between two and a half and three mil per um, filament. So definitely um, some of the best isk a new pilot can make, without a doubt. All right, let's head into the next room. Now, I have some different ships, and um, some of them are better than others. Um, there's a couple ships I like, but I just cannot get the guns to go far enough. And so it takes me a lot longer, and I take more damage, because um, the faster ships, I cannot keep up with them and hit them. All right, next room. We're going to start there and 2000. All right. So this is a striking Damovic. That'll be fine. We do pretty good against him. All right, so we're going to go ahead and turn that on. And we are here, so I'm going to turn off my afterburner. And if he gets closer, I'm going to swap to my... Um, high frequency and see how he does with it. Uh, not too bad. Oh, I think I messed up and used my new ones, which I, um, I'm going to have to take those out. I, it takes me so long to burn, um, to like damage these things that, all right. So he's been hitting us long enough. Let's get our second one going here. He's almost done, but um, taking a little bit more damage. With the trig ships, the longer they hit you, the more damage they do. It ramps up. So, there we go. Let's go ahead and go in. Look at that. That is just so cool. So cool. All right. 804,000. Turn those off. So, so far, minus those. Nah, I can't be right. All right. Got these guys again. Let's go ahead and get our radio going. We'll start hitting them from a ways back. That is just so cool. All right, turn on one wrapper. Now let's go ahead and swap out to 
these guys. And nope. That's not going to do much. All right, so let's switch to ultraviolet. Yeah, that's about the same. All right. Don't know why it's um hitting for so little right now. All right, let's try this guy. There we go. Did more damage to him. Don't know why they're the same ship. Not that big of a difference in how far apart they are. Yep, I'm back to doing about 30 to 50 on this guy. Uh don't know why that's okay though. Let's go ahead and let's go get our loot while we finish this guy off. There you go, 1.2, nice. And we'll start heading over to the gate. There we go. Easy peasy. And into the last room. These guys have done a really good job of just how they have said. Oh, that was the last room. Okay. I thought I still had one more. That's right. Okay. So let's see here. So, um, 3.3, not bad. We got a couple of electrical in here we'll be able to do. So let's go ahead and go to our safe number two. I am really liking the Punisher. So far, this has been my favorite ship. Um, I've used the Kestrel with both rockets and light missiles and eh, um, this so far has been my favorite ship. All right, so Tranquil Firestorm. We'll have to give that a moment. There we go. Alright. And away we go. Oh, now this guy might be a little bit more difficult. We're going to go ahead and switch to our navies. So as soon as I can, I'm going to go ahead and start hitting him. And what I think I'm going to do, actually, is I'm going to come in on him at 2,500. Let's go ahead and switch over to these. But this guy here, I think if we are closer to him, he won't be able to um, hit us as much. And he is staying just out of my reach, so I'm going to have to use my afterburner. All 
All right, so let's go ahead. Let's change up. Let's go with our ultraviolets since we're at this range. There we go. I was hoping I was going to be able to stick with him closer and um, hit him with those, but not going to happen, so we'll switch over. Good thing is, is we're really not taking any damage. So I am going to go ahead and turn off this second repper. So I'm not going to have any on right now. Because he is barely touching us. And so, yeah, this um, handles this guy really well. Go ahead and go with one cycle. There we go. Go ahead and approach. And let's see what we got. What does the loot fairy have for us? Eight hundred and twenty. All right. And on to the next room. We'll go ahead and put the radio in for now. Since we'll be quite a ways away. All right. We got the spark needles again. Go ahead and turn one rep around, have it ready to go. That guy is out of my range. But you, my friend, are not. One down, one to go. Go ahead and turn that off. Nine hundred twenty two thousand. All right. And let's go ahead and head over to this last gate. Boom. All right. in my ultraviolet this guy here may be harder I don't remember to be honest Really not hitting me too bad. As long as he stays at that range. I'm hitting him for a decent amount each one. And I think once I get through his armor. I don't know if that's supposed to be armor or shields. He only has two layers compared to most 
but I knew that middle one would go through quick. All right. And he is down. Go grab our loot. And see what we got. And one mil. All right. Can't remember if this was the last room or the second room. That is cool looking. I like how they're all kind of different. All right. So that was the last one. So let's go ahead. Got this here, which is worth anywhere from 900 K down to 150. We are at six mil. Very nice. So we'll warp to the next one. And those are calm. Tranquil electrical, tranquil firestorm. There we go. And it'll take a minute. Oh, nice. This time it didn't. All right. And filament number three. All right. Got one of those lancers again. Actually, if I remember right, I'm going to need to orbit him at 10. And I'll just tear him up with this and then I'll head over to the... Um, ...container there. Yep. He can't really hit me from this close, not too much. And I'm doing a nice amount of damage. Oh, and I spoke too soon. Because all of a sudden I am taking some damage. Got to make sure I'm not near that outer wall. Because that could be bad when you get there. That could be it is. All right, since he's there, I'm going to go ahead and start making my way to the container over here. There we go. Turn that off. All right. Seven hundred and seventy one thousand. So I do like the ISK from these. And as an alpha pilot, you're just you're not going to come close to this. You really aren't. I've been forgetting to watch, but I mean, I've got two and a half minutes in this first room so definitely not bad that guy takes a little bit longer than some of the others but roughly eight to nine minutes on these all right so this time what we're gonna do is instead of going around him we're just gonna go ahead and see if we can come over here and hit this thing orbit that I 
and see how this works. It's getting closer than I would like. There we go. Ideally, I'd like him about 13 to 15. But this will work. The nice thing is I'm already going to be right over here. Oh, he got a little bit of ways. All right, let's go ahead and turn off our afterburner. See what happens. He definitely can't take that um, arc on orbiting the way I can, so he was getting too far out of my range. Nice. All right. There we go. Go get loot number two. 600. So this one's not as good as the last two, but still not bad. It's 1.3. And I have been in here not even five minutes yet. And on the missions and stuff, you can't make that. You might get lucky enough exploring, but that... Really, it's going to be the only way. Mining is too slow. All right. And turn one of those on. And as soon as he gets up... There we go. He's going to be a little bit closer, I think. Well, no, now he's falling farther back. I was going to use my other ones, but now that he's falling farther back, I won't have to. I was actually very concerned with this fit. I was worried that I would run on a cap. And um, I have yet to come close. This is a great fit. All right, we're going to go ahead and slow down. He is dead. We are going to go right at him. I was hoping to be a little bit closer. There, one mil there. Great. So roughly, what about 2.3 mil? All right, and here we go. Um... So, seven minutes. Not bad at all. So, between seven and eight minutes per run. And we made... Eight million three hundred thousand. So, what I'm going to do, because I have not tried this fit in the um electrical yet yeah, should work fine but it is a little bit different than my one that i usually use for electricals um so i'm gonna go ahead and drop this loot off so i don't lose it in case you're not familiar with the abyssals you have 20 minutes to finish and if you do not finish you and your pod blow up and if you get blown up in there you and your pod get blown up 
So you either come out in one piece or you don't come out at all. All right, so we got some electricals in there, which is nice. So we are going to hang on to those. We are going to put these there. Now, I've already turned in twice. I made 40 mil the first time, and then I turned in for like 15 mil earlier today. And if you're looking at everything, I got another 26 mil now. So definitely um, just doing great with these things. So electricals, let's go ahead. We got five in there. Let's put another four. So that'll give us nine. So we can do three runs with this and get a chance to check this ship out as well. It's very close to the same fit, but not quite. And I have yet to take this fit into the abyss, so I wanted to make sure we dropped that stuff off. So let's just say it was 24 minutes, so we got 8 mil. Definitely not bad. All right. Now we are doing the electrical. Now this one will give a bonus to capacitor. All right, so we are going to go ahead and start. Out of curiosity. Yeah. With this, I am nice. I am 100% cap stable currently. All right, let's go ahead and switch to our multi frequency. We are here, so we're going to turn that off and start taking this last guy here. ahead and loot while we take him out and we are going to head to the gate 1.1 on this one here very nice and he is all but dead not sure why I'm missing though There we go. And away we go into the next room. I'm curious. Oh, I'm even capped stable with the multi-frequency. Oh, this ship is great in here. All right. So we're going to go with that. Him time to get closer. There we go. This war cap stable. We might as well just go ahead and run them both.
And 1.5. In this room here. So we just need to finish him off. So while we're doing that, I'm going to go ahead and orbit the gate. So we can make a quick getaway. So far, we are just shy of four minutes. And he is dead. So let's go ahead and get out of here. And four minutes exactly. All right, last room. And we have this little escort guy. He does more damage from, I can't remember. I think you have to keep a distance at him, but. Oh no, this isn't the one I was thinking of. Okay, so this guy's not hard at all. All right. Definitely doing well here. And I'm going to go ahead and orbit this guy here at a thousand so I can loot him. And this one is about dead. Five hundred ninety in the last one, and we are going to go ahead and get out. So it looks like this room here is going to take us six minutes. All right. So we'll go to spot number two. And we have made 4.7 mil so far. Oh, and we got more electricals. Very nice. I should have six, so we got two more in that. All right. I am going to hit this thing from the start. And then orbit it. There we go. We'll go ahead and shut those off. We don't need those. Five hundred and seventy four thousand. This one not quite as good as the other one. And we'll move over and orbit the gate while we take him out. Hmm. 
<laughs> Those effects are great. All right, just about into armor or hull. And he is down. So two minutes, two minutes for the first guy. Definitely um, taking less time than the um, firestorm. All right, make our way over to our loop. Switched over to the multi-frequency, close range ammo to take care of them. And 970 in this one. And so now we'll go ahead and loot, ah, uh, loot. <laughs> we'll go ahead and orbit the gate while we take him out. While we maybe take him out, since we're missing quite a bit. There we go. Well, we are missing a lot, so let's go ahead, turn on our afterburner, see if we can pull away from, there we go. Guess he was just a little bit too close getting up under the guns there. All right. We are at four minutes. Right. Go ahead and switch to multi frequency. And we're going to go ahead and slow down. There we go. One million even on that. Let's go ahead and orbit the gate. And what I'm going to go ahead and do is put my micro warp drive or afterburner back on. So hopefully they'll stay at a decent range without going past 10. It is so weird how they could be the same thing and take less damage. All right, we are just shy of five minutes at this point. And I am gonna go ahead and switch to ultraviolet because he's just out of range. There we go. I'm doing more damage now. We'll definitely be out of here before six minutes.
All right, well, I guess almost seven. Six and a half, but not bad still. All right. Go back to our first spot. We have at least one more. If we got another um, electrical... We did not. Let's say if we got another one, we'll have two runs. But if I gotten any, I haven't gotten any firestorm either. All right. But we got enough for one more. Let's see here. How much did we have? We got six million five hundred twenty thousand. Punisher is just a sweet ship. Sweet little frigate for these things. All right. Put my radio in so I can blast this first thing. go change to our ultraviolets and we'll just take him out as we loot and then we'll go ahead and orbit the gate while we finish we pulled farther away there we go. Now we're closing in again. All right. 994. Very nice. And he will be going down soon. All right, and we are done with this room. Look at that, under two minutes. This guy we're gonna have to Keep some range on, if I remember right. Wow, well, he's gonna try to drain me. But he's not really doing any damage, so I can shut that off. I just got to watch, make sure we don't go near the end. But he won't be an issue at all. I'm just going to go ahead and start heading over the other way. There we go. He was much easier than I thought he would be.
852,000. Let's go ahead and get out of this room. And we are just hair over four minutes. And we are going to have an easy time in this last room. Nope. One of the mods have frequency. There we go. Come on, finish them off. One mil. All right. And now for the last one. We are just shy of six minutes. There we go, six minutes. Nice. Love when a plan comes together. All right, let's see here. We have made 8.6 and don't have enough. Oh, yes, we do. All right. Got enough to do one more electrical. So let's go ahead. Oh, I can't do it here. So we'll land over there and knock that out. Come on. There we go. Put in our radio. All right. Yeah, bouncing off the rocks. Oh, he's hitting me hard already. That's right, he hits better from a distance. Plus, with me hitting those rocks, I was did not have much momentum going. Alright, so we're going to change to Ultraviolet. And we are going to take him out on the way to... Pick up our loot. And 1.25. Very nice. For some reason, he's gotten farther away. Now this one's going to take a little bit longer to kill. I don't know why he's sitting so far away. There we go. Now he's getting better within range.
All right. Just about dead. There we go. And just touch over two minutes in that first room. We got the striking Damovic. Take him out on the way. Put our second one on. Get our loot. One point one two. Definitely not bad. And let us get out of here. So we are two minutes, four minutes in. And we have a lucid escort for our last one. Very nice. No complaints. Blow this up while we're heading over there. Switch to our ultraviolet for this guy. Very nice. Ah, four hundred fifty nine thousand. Yeah. I was hoping for a little bit more, but still can't complain. Not bad. All right, let's get out of here. And we are not quite six minutes in. Or a little over six minutes in. Very nice. So I have been streaming for an hour. I would say probably lost about five minutes going from place to place. Travel time. I made eight and a half mil on the first round. And this time 10 mil. So not bad. 19, not what? 19.2 mil. Um, definitely not bad. And that blueprint copy is anywhere from like 100k to 900k, depending on how many are up there. But I would probably go with 100k. Um, so 
definitely a nice ship as you could see no worries whatsoever i i never had to sweat it um i am you know looking i'm in one in about 1.4 million skill points which is very low and so you know very new alpha pilots can go ahead and do the same okay um i'm doing it with minimal skills and for the most part, everything on my ship is T1. So I'm using T1 guns. Now I do have a couple T2 um, rigs, but that doesn't matter. Those are all T1 and that. So, I mean, this whole ship is T1, except for the rigs. And those really don't require any skills. So um, anybody can come in and do this. So if you are a new pilot or you're just coming back, this is a great way to get some ISK in your wallet and um, getting going. So um, with that, if you enjoyed this, please go ahead and press that like button and subscribe and also click that notification so you know when I will be posting things again. Um, so that is all for now. So remember, as always, 